Pluto is a distant and perplexing planet, which was once a member of our solar system's planetary family. However, a later, disturbing announcement by leading astrophysicists Neil deGrasse Tyson and Michio Kaku has brought Pluto back into the spotlight with a staggering revelation. They propose that this cold world is on a potential collision course with Neptune. But how could this happen, and what might be the consequences of such a significant event? Are we witnessing a captivating cosmic phenomenon, or is there more to this looming giant collision? Join us as we explore the possibilities of a Pluto-Neptune impact. Pluto, once a planet that was downgraded to a dwarf planet mainly due to its unusual orbit, remains a subject of interest and study in the cosmic community. According to recent forecasts by leading analysts, Pluto's orbit is dangerously close to Neptune's. Leading astrophysicists Neil deGrasse Tyson and Michio Kaku are both raising concerns about a potential dangerous impact between these two planets, which could pose a huge threat to Earth. But how is such an event even possible? Pluto's journey around the Sun is unlike any other planet in our solar system. It takes a remarkable 248 years to complete a single orbit, meaning that since its discovery in 1930, it hasn't even completed one full revolution yet. The intrigue doesn't stop there. Pluto's path is marked by its highly elliptical shape, deviating significantly from the nearly circular orbits of the major planets. What makes Pluto's orbit even more unusual is its inclination, measured at 17 degrees to the ecliptic plane. The path Pluto follows is much steeper compared to the other planets. This inclination and elliptical nature add layers of complexity to its orbital pattern. One of the most interesting aspects of Pluto's orbit is its intersection with Neptune's path. For around 20 years in each orbit, Pluto actually comes closer to the Sun than Neptune, contradicting what we might expect from their positions in the solar system. This leads to the natural question, why hasn't Pluto collided with Neptune? The answer lies in the gravitational effects of other planets. The study of Pluto's orbit began shortly after its discovery. Initially, astronomers tried to figure out its peculiar path, unlike other planets whose orbits lie somewhat close to the ecliptic plane. Pluto's path stood out with its steep inclination and elliptical shape. The mystery grew with the realization that Pluto's orbit actually crosses Neptune's. The stability of Pluto's orbit amid these complexities is proof of the intricacies of space mechanics. The three-body problem in space involves determining how three objects, like Pluto, Neptune, and the Sun, move and influence each other with their gravity. It's like trying to predict where they will go based on where they start and how they pull on each other. In Pluto's case, this issue illustrates how its path, Neptune's path, and the Sun's gravity all interact in a complex way. The terms AOL vibration, scope vibration, and the VZK oscillation are essential pieces of this puzzle, according to astrophysicists. What keeps all planets in their orbits is AOL vibration. In the case of Pluto and Neptune, this term means that whenever Pluto crosses Neptune's orbit, it is positioned about 90 degrees away from Neptune. This spatial separation is essential in preventing their orbits from merging. Scope vibration, on the other hand, refers to the vertical movement of a celestial body in its orbit. For Pluto, this means that when it comes closest to Neptune or any other giant planet, it is located well above their orbital plane, providing an additional layer of protection from potential collisions. Another key aspect of the situation is the VZK oscillation, named after three scientists, von Zeipel, Kozai, and Litov, who studied how objects move in space. It describes how three space objects like Pluto, Neptune, and the Sun pull on each other with their gravity. This gravitational tug affects how they move. In Pluto's case, the VZK oscillation helps us understand why its orbit around the Sun is so unusual. Even though Pluto's path seems chaotic, this oscillation helps keep it moving smoothly for long periods. The VZK oscillation shows that even when things in space seem wild and random, certain patterns and rules keep everything together. These factors help maintain Pluto's orbit stability, ensuring it doesn't collide with Neptune or veer off course. This three-body problem helps us understand how gravitational forces interact and change based on how these space objects pull on each other. 
Studying this helps us learn more about Pluto, our solar system, and distant universes and their stars. Mathematical simulations in the late 1980s revealed that despite these stable properties, Pluto's orbit is actually chaotic, with minor deviations in initial conditions leading to massive differences over millennia. However, these unique properties of Pluto's orbit have been found to maintain stability over incredibly long timescales, still keeping the confusion in check. Recent virtual simulations have helped us understand how the giant planets like Neptune, Jupiter, and Saturn influence Pluto's path around the Sun Neptune, has a unique relationship with Pluto where, for every two orbits Pluto completes around the Sun, Neptune completes three. This relationship helps keep Pluto's path stable. But Neptune isn't the only one helping. Jupiter's gravity also plays a significant role in protecting Pluto's orbit. In fact, Jupiter's gravity alone is strong enough to ensure Pluto remains on a stable path for a long time, even billions of years. So, it appears as though Neptune, Jupiter, and Saturn are working together to ensure Pluto continues to move safely in space without running into trouble. These characteristics are significant in the broader context of the universe, maintaining the order and consistency of celestial bodies' movements. Without these mechanisms, our solar system would be a much more chaotic and unpredictable place. Bodies like Pluto could potentially collide with others or be ejected from their stable orbits, leading to cascading effects on other celestial bodies. For Pluto, especially with discussions of it potentially colliding with Neptune in the future, Understanding its orbit is very important. It gives us a clearer picture of the solar system's dynamic nature. The case of Pluto illustrates how even the most seemingly unstable orbits can achieve a state of balance through the complex interplay of gravitational forces and orbital mechanics. It also shows the importance of constant observation and study of these movements to more readily comprehend our position in the universe. Investigating the profundities of space frequently drives us to confront the inconsistent nature of celestial bodies. Pluto's orbit is an ideal portrayal of this eccentricity. The idea of orbital chaos, which refers to the delicate dependence of a celestial body's path on its initial conditions, is strikingly outlined in the case of Pluto. This means that even slight variations in the dwarf planet's position or speed can drastically change its long-term orbit. Using virtual simulations has been extremely helpful for scientists in understanding how Pluto moves in space. These simulations use complex mathematics to model how Pluto and other space objects, like Neptune, interact. By adjusting minor details in the simulations, Astronomers can see how even small changes can have a significant impact on where Pluto ends up. In the late 1980s, these simulations revealed something fascinating about Pluto's orbit. Despite having mechanisms like apsidal and latitude libration to keep it stable, its path remains stable yet complex. Its stability relies on intricate gravitational interactions that keep it in check. Despite its unique path, Pluto's orbit remains consistent thanks to factors like apsidal libration, latitude libration, and vertical oscillation, which work together to balance the generally chaotic forces at play. These findings underline how every celestial body in our solar system is part of a larger cosmic puzzle, where even minor gravitational nudges can have significant effects. For Pluto, these mechanisms prevent it from colliding with Neptune and help maintain a predictable path. As scientists continue to run simulations and gather data, they can further refine our understanding of how Pluto's orbit and similar peculiarities function. The study of Pluto's orbit is not just crucial for understanding our solar system, but also contributes to broader astrophysical theories about orbital mechanics and stability across the universe. In the end, Pluto's complex journey reminds us that even in a universe filled with vast distances, and seemingly endless possibilities. Precise gravitational forces govern every celestial body, holding the universe together in a delicate balance. This knowledge gives us the ability to predict and appreciate the intricate dance of planets, stars, and moons, a reminder of the fascinating mechanics that guide everything from Pluto's path to the movements of galaxies beyond our own. Pluto's orbit can still be wild and unpredictable. If you start with just a tiny difference in where Pluto is or how fast it's moving over many years, 
its path can end up looking very different. Yet even with this chaos, Pluto's orbit remains stable for a long time, like billions of years. This means Pluto's journey around the Sun has a certain order to it, even though it might seem all over the place at first. Predicting endless events, especially when they involve chaotic orbits like Pluto's, presents significant challenges. The inherent unpredictability of these systems means that long-term predictions are often filled with uncertainties. While mathematical simulations provide a solid means to understand and predict the future behavior of celestial bodies, they also highlight the limitations of our predictive abilities. These models heavily depend on the accuracy of initial conditions and the complexity of the interactions they simulate. Any slight error or misrepresentation can lead to vastly different outcomes, making precise predictions a daunting task. Besides, the chaotic nature of celestial orbits like Pluto's reminds us of the ever-evolving and dynamic nature of the universe. While we've made great strides in understanding space, the case of Pluto serves as a reminder of how our knowledge of the universe is still limited. Understanding the gravitational effects of the giant planets on Pluto's orbit provides valuable insights into the broader dynamics of the solar system. It shows how the presence and position of each planet can significantly impact the stability and trajectory of other bodies within the system. So, why are leading astrophysicists only now raising concerns about a potential collision between Pluto and Neptune despite all these complex forces working to prevent such an event? Neil deGrasse Tyson, a prominent astrophysicist and a major figure in popularizing cosmology, offers a unique perspective on the mysteries of our solar system, particularly the intriguing case of Pluto. Tyson, known for his role in reclassifying Pluto from a planet to a dwarf planet, gives quick talks on the evolving nature of celestial mechanics and the public's fascination with the unknown realms of space. Tyson's stance on Pluto's reclassification is rooted in the ever-expanding knowledge of our solar system. He views the reclassification not as a demotion, but rather as an important adjustment to our growing understanding of the many bodies orbiting our sun. His approach to celestial mechanics is one of continuous learning and adaptation. He sees the complexities of orbits like Pluto's as a reminder of how much more there is to discover in space. The interest in these questions, especially the possible interactions between Pluto and Neptune, highlights the dynamic and often unpredictable nature of our solar system. His work underscores that the more we uncover about space, the more questions arise, pushing us to explore further and refine our understanding of the universe. Michio Kaku, another renowned physicist and futurist, offers a different yet complementary perspective on the mysteries of space focusing on the often unpredictable forces that shape our universe. Kaku is known for his ability to connect complex scientific concepts with cutting-edge visions, making him a significant voice in discussions about celestial mechanics and the broader implications for humanity. Kaku's views on Pluto and its orbit emphasize the need for constant observation and advanced modeling to predict and understand potential cosmic events. He sees the interactions between celestial bodies as a crucial area of study, not just for academic curiosity, but for practical implications. The potential interaction between Pluto and Neptune, for example, is not just a hypothetical scenario, but a reminder of the dynamic and often chaotic nature of space. Kaku's futurist perspective urges us to consider the broader implications of such events from the impact on our understanding of the solar system to the potential need for future space interventions. Kaku's viewpoint highlights the importance of being prepared for the unexpected in space.